Hey, my name is Mike Tataro. I'm going to talk with you today about a project that I helped lead in 2019 on the Amazon forest fire that happened around August. Um, so I found out through a meme that the lungs of the earth was on fire, burning, and there was a media blackout. And since no one knew, no one said anything and less did anything. Um, when I found this out through a meme, of all places on the internet, um, I saw red. I got really, really angry. I'm never that angry in my life, still. <laughs> um, you know, I'm a metalhead, I'm a drummer, I'm a punk rock fan, you know, it, since I'm young. Anger is not very foreign to me, <laughs> but um, I never saw red before like that day. My head vibrated, and a voice in my head came to me and said, Put it out, Mike. So I did. I did what I had to do. Um, I gathered uh, some people, starting with a friend who's also a remote viewer, uh, um, Jana Lynn. I said to her, uh, I think on her Facebook page too, publicly, I said, hey, the lungs of the earth is on fire. No one's doing anything. Do you know any other water witches? She said, yeah, I think I could talk to some people. So I created this event. We gathered some folks. Um, there was about 70 people that or at least interested, if not attending actively, this uh, weeks-long event. And there were about 10 people in the group chat, synchronizing goals, uh, intentions, uh, synchronizing our focus, where our attention goes uh, on the weather systems near Brazil. Um, we had the help of Danny Caputi, a sci researcher and atmospheric grad student who directed us, sort of, you know, uh, where to put our focus, where to apply our intention, the, in, you know, the intention to apply um, in those areas. And others in the group, in, I think including Danny, if memory serves, provided feedback on a daily basis. So one day we would all synchronize in the group chat and we would do our thing however we did it. We all have our different methods, you know. I, I can't speak to anyone else's method. I can only speak for my own, and that's not what this particular video is for. But we synchronized um, on the day's goal each day. And the next day we had our feedback. And it was, I think, incredible. I'm, I'm not more proud of anything else that I've ever done in my life or, or I've ever been a part of. Not that I did it, but that... I've ever been a part of. I still can't think of anything better. Um, after a while of us essentially targeting a foreign nation with a hurricane, I, used, I called it the Category 4 fire extinguisher. <laughs> um, but I didn't, I, I didn't want to claim it as that. That's why I got rid of the group chat. Some people started calling it our baby and, and, and all sorts of things that I just didn't like to do at the time. Now, I might be a little bit more open to things now, but then it was not okay. So I got rid of the group chat. But by the time we had um, had some successes, a, couple, a week maybe, maybe a week or so into this project, um, it got global recognition. Not the project, the Amazon. The Amazon burning got global recognition, which is a good thing. That means more people can do stuff to help, not just us, you know? Um, Bolsonaro met with Trump. I don't know what they talked about, really, but shortly after that, the G6 moved in, or G7, whatever they are, whatever they call themselves. <laughs> what am I thinking? Like a G6. <laughs> so the G7 moved in and, uh, and started helping. So the armies of the world, essentially, got onto it after several weeks of it burning. And uh, that's where we took our leave. The event ended. I believe I flew out to New Mexico for a couple weeks. Um, and we just kept living our lives, you know? I started training in the desert and honing my abilities, my skill. It's not an ability, it's a skill. And I think anyone can learn it. That's really what I've been working on for the most part, is 
trying to find how it works. How do I do this? How does this happen? Can it be replicated? Can other people learn how to do this too that have never done it before? I'm going to try to cut this now at five, a little over five minutes, but um, that's the nature of, of my work. It doesn't pay very well, <laughs> but I think the payoff is going to be evident for future generations. And I think that's more important than any monetary payout in the short term. So.